Hello, my name is Aaron Britton, and I am mining with a Praxis. You might not have ever seen that before. I like mining with my Praxis. It was given to me by someone named Bo, so it's still called Bo's Praxis. Anyway, I wanted to show you something. Usually, what I do is I mine until I'm full, then I jettison, then I watch my jettisoned can get sucked up by my mobile tractor unit. And I like to name them silly things like sticky fingers. So I have decided that I'm done mining for today. So I'm going to go and pick up my cargo container. That's what I call it. <laughs> it's actually not a cargo container. But I, I, like, I like calling things silly names. So what I'm going to do is go home. Uh, warp 2. Go home to Takema. And I'm going to pick up my ore using my cargo container, which isn't really a cargo container. And then I'm going to show you how to compress ore at a facility. Now, the trick to finding a place to compress ore is one, you need to know how to find a place that compresses ore. And two, you need to have permission to dock with whatever it is in order to get in there and compress ore. Uh, you don't always have permission to dock with a station. So that's the second thing. And I'm going to show you how to find one. So first thing you need to do to find one as I'm traveling to Takema is you go to Utilities, Structure Browser, and, if, and one thing you need to know about structures is that there are player structures and there are NPC structures. The NPC structures are called stations. Everything else is not called a station. So to find what you want, you have to unselect station from the list of structure, from the structure type list. Okay, and then all these others you don't want. You only want a refinery because a refinery will have the uh, uh, what's it called? The equipment that you need for for doing that, for compressing stuff. Once you've selected the type of structure, you need to select reprocessing plant only. Get rid of everything else and only select reprocessing plant in the service filter. Then it'll show you only the structures that have what you need. Let's dock with Takema and get my cargo container, which isn't really a cargo container. Oh, I just remembered that I forgot to uh, mark the location for my mobile tractor unit. Oh well, I will find it. Anyway, so, Tarda Z sector is closest to me, that's where I usually go to compress my ore. But I can go somewhere else on that list. See? Cargo container. <laughs> it's actually an Iteron or Iteron Mark V. I'm gonna move some my ore 
and mark that ship as active. Make active. Then I'm gonna undock and go and get my ore and my mobile tractor unit. I don't want to lose it. I've lost some. I don't like losing my stuff. So how I'm going to find it again is I'm going to go back to Tarta where I was. Jump to the Stargate. And then I'm going to you know, use my fleet uh, connections my fleet chat to um, go to the person that I was close to when I was mining. Oh, the reason that this is shown on my map is because I'm looking at fleet members. You can change what shows up by going to the gear in your map and selecting what things you want it to show on your map. So there's corp members, security status, manufacturing facilities, fleet members, triglavid invasion on my recent list. Um, I like looking at my flight members on the my map. So I can, you know, Go mine with people, because I'm in a mining fleet. Cast mining. I forget what cast stands for. Whatever. Anyway, now I'm in Tarta, so I can warp to member using the fleet drop down. I'm gonna warp to be near him. And then I'm going to find my <coughs> mobile tractor unit. Where's my mobile tractor unit? There it is, sticky fingers. I'm going to save location. Submit. Now that that's saved. Where did it, where is it save? I forget. People in places, that's where. Personal locations. Sticky fingers. So that's where I'm keeping it. I want to jump to it. But I'm not I'm not farther and far enough away to jump to it. And it would take a long time to approach. I don't want to approach. So what I want to do is jump to something else. And then jump to my sticky fingers mobile tractor unit. Come on, jump already. Really? Why is it taking so long?
Wow, because I'm too close to that guy. Let's go already, jeez. <sighs> Fine. Let's jump somewhere else then. Oh. Okay, now we're finally warping. It seems like warping takes a long time, but believe me, it takes a lot less time to warp to this place and then warp to my sticky fingers than it would to just fly because this ship is slow. Okay. Warp to location within zero meters. Warp drive active. Once I get there, I'm going to grab my ore and stuff out of my mobile tractor unit, and then grab my mobile tractor unit, and then we can head off to a place to compress my ore. And this is what I do for hours and hours and hours. I just mine and compress ore and mine and compress ore and then sell it using the cast mining uh, or selling system whatever you call it there we go click the open cargo button select all the cargo Move it to my cargo container. <sighs> Not enough cargo space. Well, I really messed that up, didn't I? Gotta dock and drive change some things about my cargo containers setup. I need those extended cargo holds installed. Why did I do that? I don't know. I'm silly. Equipment, or whatever you call it. Docking request accepted. This on, fit this on, fit this on, fit this on, and fit this on. Undock. Now I have enough space. Or I should. Go. Get. Sticky fingers. can't be the only one who screws up like this on occasion, huh, huh, huh? Come on. 
Thank you. Select all. Move everything to my cargo container. There! Then, to grab my my uh, mobile tractor unit, I click, I right click on it, on the list, the general overview list, and click scoop to cargo hold. <laughs> now it's in my ship, and I can go find a place to compress my ore using the structure browser. I usually go to Z sector, but I can also go to Igmat Refinery. MC-151, MC-152, another Igmat in Zuhen, Lion's Den in Nesreri, whatever. Anyway, I'm going to Z Sector. Stack on. There. Now everything's together. And I have a bunch of stuff from destroyed enemies. They keep attacking me and I, my drones just keep blowing them up. <gasps> I forgot to pick up my drones. I'll have to do that before I leave. I keep forgetting things. Wow. Docking request accepted. Okay, so I'm gonna take out all my stuff, select all, drop it in my item hanger, go to my item hanger. Like platinoid, amber, oh wait, stack all. There we go. And then click on compress. There we go, it's been compressed. Now I gotta go get my drones. Where did I put my praxis? I keep forgetting things. I'm gonna grab a Marla. Find my praxis. I need assets. I can't remember where I put praxis. Search. Praxis. Oh, yeah, it came a five. No, oh, nine. As soon as I'm done getting my drones, I gotta go back home. I mean, not go back home. Um, get off. Yeah, I gotta get off the computer. Concord assembly plant. Docking Dock permission requested. Docking request accepted. Oh, come on. Let's go. Let's get my praxis out of 
here. Undock. Jump through Stargate. Woohoo! I'm gonna go right through the station again! Silly, 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 silly game! Oh, it hurts! I've taken the CBD oil. Which Dad got, and I'm very, very grateful for. But it's not helping enough. It hurts. What would really help is freaking marijuana. because it's no longer there. And I don't need it anymore once I get my drone. Connect to lost drones. There we go. They're all returning to me. Yeehaw. All right. What was it? Oh, home. Home brings all my drones back. Yep, I set the home key for drone to to drones to return and I set the insert key to launch drones. Makes it real easy for me. You know, when I remember, I need to stop forgetting that stuff. Alrighty then, guess that's it. Okay, time to stop the recording. Bye.